Coastal Carolina hosting the Presbyterian Blue Hose. Chauncey, the CCU mascot, was in a playful mood, but the shots weren't. Danny Neiman buries a three, shots up 5 0 early. Then it's Anthony Rafa off the steal, takes it coast to coast. The shots are up 12 to 2 and never trailed in this one. Coastal forced 18 Presbyterian turnovers on the day and hit better than 53% from the field. Dexter Moore coming off the bench to provide some more offense, scores off a nice baseline move, gives CCU a 15-point advantage. Another player coming off the pine, Chris Grandigo. He led the shots in scoring with 18 points. That was a pretty turnaround, Jay. Grand to go, another solid game for Coastal. Second half, CCU continues to hit from the outside. Danny Neiman, he was six for six from the field, including four threes. Coastal Carolina beat Presbyterian 81 to 63. CCU improves to 13 and four overall, six and one in the Big South Conference. The shots remain one game behind first place UNC Asheville in the Big South standings. CCU head coach Cliff Ellis was pleased with the shots performance against Presbyterian. There's no question that uh, the flow that we had early was a big, big key. I thought we played well. This is one of the, one of the better games that we played in a while. Uh, and uh, just proud of our team. So it felt good to, to keep a lead and hold a lead, and we kept them to 60 points. So we played pretty good defense, but we're, we're going to find some negatives out of it and turn them into positives.